Another test that uses explosions to help build a better plane is this joint effort by NASA and the Federal Aviation Administration. Their plan is to make this jet's fuel tanks erupt during a staged crash. By doing this, experts hope to reduce the threat of fires during forced landings. In December of 1984, the four-engine transport jet takes off from Edwards Air Force Base, California. There's no pilot or crew on board. Instead, this plane is being flown by remote control. Back on the ground, a special runway has been constructed to create the most fiery landing possible. The surface is covered with railroad trap rock to generate more sparks. Special wing cutters are positioned to slice open the plane's engines and fuel lines. As cameras roll, the aircraft comes in for its landing. The jet skids to a halt and erupts into a massive fireball, just as engineers had hoped. As the plane touches down, a wing cutter punctures the right inboard engine, releasing large amounts of fuel and prompting the explosion. Incredibly, despite the magnitude of the blast, flames are unable to invade the fuselage and burn the test dummies inside. Later inspection of the fuselage and interior provides engineers with the valuable data they need to help improve crash protection and reduce the threat of fire. Experts believe that when it comes to air safety, the explosion that you know is safer than the explosion that you don't know. But when science uses the power of explosions to create better forms of travel, they're dealing with a 